What's going on everybody? Welcome back to Phones and Drones. I wanted to do a little more hands-on time with the Apple TV 4K. It does have quite a few new options that never used to be available on the Apple TV. Um, even as far as just the 4K resolution goes, you'll see you have standard 4K, you have 4K HDR, you have 4K at 60 hertz, uh, etc., etc. I just want to show you how to change those options if you need to. Uh, it's very simple. This video will only take a second to show you. Uh, when you're on the home screen for the Apple TV, all you're going to do is scroll to the little gear icon like you would in any other iOS device. Click on it to go to the settings. And then when you're in this menu, you'll go to option number three, the video and audio option. And you'll see right here, uh, if your TV is capable, you can enable HDR. And it'll run through this test to see if your TV is capable and compatible to work with it. If not, it'll let you know. My TV is HDR compatible. However, for some reason, I keep getting a darker image. Uh, and it actually looks worse for some reason than my uh, SDR looks. So I leave it off for now, but that's up to you. Uh, aside from that, here's the other format we were just talking about. Here's all your new options uh, for 4K HDR at 60 hertz or standard at 60, then 4K at 50 hertz, and then your regular 1080p HDR and standard options. Um, that's really it. If you actually dig into the settings menu, you'll be able to see in general all the other new options down here as well um, that I'm not too familiar with. That's probably just an update for iOS 11. Uh, and not so much unique for the Apple TV 4K. But that's it. I hope this helps y'all uh, if y'all need to change your resolution at all. Thanks for watching, guys. We'll have more hands-on uh, and other walkthroughs later in the week.